Um, in creating a piece for dance, I wanted to ensure that there was um, a great deal of rhythmic drive and something that the dancers expressed that uh, they found to be very evocative as well. And so throughout the piece, I tried to develop uh, rhythm. Um, the, first, the first draft I wrote was less rhythmically driven. It was more coloristic, more textural. Um, and when I sent it to them, the dancers, they said, Ah, uh, really wish we could have a pulse in there. And I thought, well, I thought there was a little bit of a pulse. So then in the next draft, I created a more of a underlying constant rhythm where it's kind of pounding. I was, I kept in mind uh, Stravinsky's Rite of Spring as a model for uh, driven rhythmic dance music. Ballet music is, is of course, the Rite of Spring. Um, so that was one of the challenges to, to keep a regular pulse because in most of my music there's an irregular pulse. Uh, you know, it doesn't fit into 4-4 four, four, or 3-4 four, or 2-4 or whatever it may be. So that was one of the challenges. Um, but I think in the end I, I met the dancers halfway where I had a, a, a constant pulse for a large portion of the piece but it interchanged between more textural and coloristic um, uh, gestures as well.